cervical or neck collars are commonly used by patients who have had undergone uh, surgeries of cervical spine this is basically used to immobilize the neck it is also used as a treatment of neck pain caused by acute trauma or any kind of chronic pain the main goal of cervical or neck collars is to prevent or minimize motion in the cervical spine it also keeps the head in a comfortable position and minimize movement in the cervical spine it keeps your head in a comfortable gravity aligned position maintaining the cervical uh, lordosis now these cervical collars are of two types soft collars and rigid collars soft collars are basically made of sponge or foam or felt these are cut out to mold your neck and your jaw and to keep the head and neck in a comfortable position partially immobilizing the area soft collars are basically made up of foam or sponge or felt they are cut to mold around the area of the neck and jaw and can be easily adjusted by the patient themselves these collars do not completely immobilize the neck but keeps it in a resting position these collars can be used by people who are having any kind of acute pain due to acute traumas any cervical conditions it keeps your neck in a comfortable position this type of collar does not truly immobilize the neck it only limits the flexion and extension in the end phases these collars provide a close fit around the neck which restricts perspirations now rigid collars rigid collars are also of the same design as the soft collars but are constructed out of rigid or hard material such as plexiglass these are also easily applied and are easy to clean and use and has an advantage of the plastic collars this type of collar is also available in different sizes as per the need of the patient these collars completely restricts the flexion and extension they not only provide support to your chin but also in the occipital reg uh, region reducing active extension especially in the end phase now for how long should we wear these kind of collars what is the recommended usage duration usually doctors recommend to use the cervical or neck collars to be worn constantly for one week for the reason of pain relief after that the collar should be gradually decreased if the collar is worn for a longer period of time it can have several negative effects on the neck such as soft tissue contractions muscle weakness or atrophy there can also be loss of proprioceptions and coordinations there can be thickening of subscapular tissues so the ideal period of time for the wearing of your collars are for one week not more than that but it can be adjusted according to the patient's need as well it can be increased or decreased as per the doctor's advice thank you